Hi everyone, in this video we're going to be solving the 2021 anti-10a problem 8. It also came on the anti-12a as a problem 5. When a student multiplied the number 66 by the repeating decimal 1.ABAB, or also known as 1.AB bar, which basically means AB repeating on and over again, like they say here, where A and B are digits. But what he did not notice is that the notation and just multiplied 66 times 1.AB. In this answer, we, we found that 0 0.5 less than the correct answer. So this is very important. What is a two-digit integer A, B? So let's just, this seems strange, right? We have bar A, B, not bar A, B. Well, let's try to express it algebraically. So we can see that 1.A, B is equal to 1 plus whatever A, B is. I'm talking about A, B, the number, not A, B, the not AB, A times B. So I'll just put a line like they said here. So AB, the number, divided by 100, right? Because so you, the tenths and hundredths place in the decimal. And this is equal to, we're saying that, so you're saying that this is the number that, that the student multiplied by when he was actually supposed to multiply by the repeating decimal. So the repeating, what is the repeating decimal? 1.AB bar. Well, it's a common property that of repeating decimals that don't terminate, that repeat over 100 and 100, it's just going to equal to 1 plus AB over 99. So we can see that multiplying 66 by this quantity here, 1 plus AB over 100, we're saying that is 0 0.5 less, so it's going to be equal to plus 0 0.5 is going to be equal to 66 times 1 plus AB over 99. So now, what can we do from there? We can see that 66 plus AB over 100 times 66 plus 0 0.5 will have to equal to 66 plus AB over 99 times 66. So from here, we can cancel 66 from both sides and see that, and see that our expansion is just going to be equal to AB over 99 minus AB over 100. We know that 66 times this quantity is equal to 0 0.5 or 1 half. And then from here, we can simplify further and see that 66 times AB over 9900 is 1 half. And we essentially can, we can just from there divide by 66 to both sides to get that. From here, we can see that. Let me just move this a little bit. We can see that AB over 9900 equal to 1 over 132. And then we can see that AB is just going to be equal to 9900 over 32, 132, which is going to be equal to 900 divided by 12, which is equal to 450 divided by 6, which is just going to be equal to 450 divided by 6, which is just going to be equal to 75. And that's the answer for this problem. So the main idea on this type, these types of problems is, is to just look at what you're trying and try to write it algebraically because using repeating decimals might seem a little bit tricky. Thank you all for watching and I hope to see you all in the next video.